Dominica's ambassador to the United States of America and permanent representative to the Organization of American States, His Excellency Ambassador Dr. Vince Henderson, presented pertinent questions with regards to Dominica's development. Henderson was this year's keynote speaker at the 15th annual graduation ceremony of the Dominica State College and said a number of critical issues need to be addressed in Dominica. He underscored the need for a change in a number of sectors, including education and agriculture. Over 300 students graduated from the DSC on Wednesday at the Windsor Park Sports Stadium. Should we, in light of climate change and the impact that hurricanes continue to have every season on bananas, in light of the fact that Black Sigatoa will continue because of the climatic conditions that have changed over the last decade, should we then be looking to a new form of production and move away from being mere producers to value added and building a knowledge-based economy? Henderson called for a more revolutionized and demand-driven education system in Dominica. Shouldn't we be rethinking the relevance of school, of education, and make it more demand-driven in the 21st century? Should we continue to compete amongst ourselves rather than among the world? Should we be satisfied with results that we do at CXC and compare ourselves with the other Caribbean countries rather than benchmarking our performance against international standards? How do we start thinking of building a new Dominica? He told the graduates that they too play an integral part in Project Dominica and challenged the graduates to think outside the box and strive to elevate themselves and Dominica. Project Dominica. I call it Project Dominica, a term that I borrow from my friend Ambassador Charles, but I give my own definition to it. That after almost 40 years of independence, how do we pursue a development path that can take Dominica forward so that all of us can enjoy in its prosperity? A development path that is sustainable and that can be resilient to the impact of climate change and other global shocks. That is what you, class of 2017, need to engage yourselves in. To move away from the personal and petty issues that continue to pervade our society and occupy our time. All the malpale, all the mepuise, all the things that we do from morning till night, on the airways, on the internet, attacking one another, destroying each other and destroying our country. Is that the Dominica you want to inherit? Meantime, the Minister for Education, Peter Seja, told the graduates that a hopeful nation raises its eyes at them and encourage them to give back to their country, which has lent support over the years. The highest academic awards were awarded to Stephanie Pascal. She obtained the highest grade point average in the graduating class. And Stephanie Pascal was named valedictorian. She demonstrated consistent academic excellence and participated in extracurricular activities on campus. The sports personality of the year was Romelcia Phillip. And also in our news.